Hey guys, welcome back. Compliments of the season once again. Today, um, I'm going to be taking you guys on a little different journey. Since tomorrow is my birthday and um, we have a few guests who will be coming over. A few friends of mine, a few family members. So, mom is preparing her speciality, that's mutton biryani. And I'm going to be preparing my favorite dessert, that's tiramisu. So I'm going to take you guys on this um, small journey of the birthday celebration. Uh, we have bought a couple of uh, grocery items as well and uh, it is all spread out in the kitchen for now. So it's kind of a little messy. So I need to put those things in place. Also, I need to give Ginger a bath. I guess he had a little fight with the cats outside. And he seems to be a little stinky and messy. So I need to give him bath and probably that would be in the later part of the day um but yeah before that i need to put things in place i need to uh, help my mom in cooking and um and then maybe do the dessert so um well i'm doing the tiramisu cheesecake so um let's get started okay guys so you can see over here we have bought a couple of stuff like beers we have some wine bottles we have some aerated drinks some sauces and some snacks so this is all for tomorrow but i need to put this thing in place and clear this whole table so mom has already started her prep for tomorrow and while she's doing the cooking i'm going to be organizing this whole pantry as well as put the stuff from the table in its place and after that's done i'm going to go and help her cook So as you can see, the kitchen countertop is a mess right now. I would call it the hot cooking mess. I'm all over the place and mom needed help to refill the oil can. So uh, I did that as quickly as possible so that I could complete the remaining uh, part of putting the grocery items in place. I also put back the kitchen containers and tiffins that were lying on the table after wash. Uh, they all had dried up and needed to go back in place. Well, as you can see, even dad was not spared for the day. Mom actually um, made him uh, clean the onions, uh, saute them, clean the garlic, um, but uh, he was all happy to do it actually. Well, I couldn't take the countertop being dirty any much longer. So, um, as mom uh, went out to clean the fish, I decided to clean the countertop and uh, wash the dishes that were lying down in the sink. Well, next I decided to change the linen of my bed since it's my birthday and I decided to go with this uh, teddy bear print bed sheet that I used to use quite a long time back and um, I did so because uh, although I'm growing older, you know, I still have that kiddishness inside me and 
who would like to grow older actually uh, i still want to be you know that small kid well the the pillowcases were kind of little small but i tried and pushed it through um yeah so that's about it mom wanted me to taste the mutton gravy that she had prepared for the biryani for the following day and um, what i could say she's a super cook uh, she has a recipe of her own that i really like um so i don't think she needs a person to taste actually um but yeah she always does that if uh, if we could like you know um give her any um inputs on if anything has to be added so once we were done cooking for the day and we also finished our lunch i um wanted to start with the base for the cheesecake also i forgot to get the whipping cream so i had to go to the market to get some uh meanwhile since the base needs to be set um i decided to do the base and uh, refrigerate it and um in the later part of the day i could you know start with the whole uh, cheese making cheesecake making process well for those uh, who want to know the recipe for the cheesecake i'm going to mention it down in the description box for you guys to check it out Wrapped up without a choice, yeah. Hair blown round to the window, singing stupid noise. So will you? I just wanna get to know ya. I wanna go far to the coast, yeah. I wanna drive fast to the ocean. I wanna know all of you. Well, as I mentioned earlier, I wanted to give Ginger a bath, and um, I used the shampoo from Lozello. I guess it comes in different fragrances. and i have been using this for quite some time now and it's a pretty good one actually well for those who wanted to know how do i groom ginger uh yes i do give him a bath with some lukewarm water um like every 15 days um and uh, he really enjoys it i guess uh yeah he does want to run away and shake off the excess water on him but uh, he never cries um He wants to be clean as well, uh, just like me. I use a metal brush to um, brush his coat of fur, and um, brushing really helps in reducing the amount of fur that gets onto your couches, on your uh, black pens, on your furniture. So brushing really helps to keep your house clean. If you are a person who allows your pet inside the house. Well a lot of you have been asking me what does ginger actually eat so ginger has a thing for mackerels he likes his rice to be cooked along with the mackerel and some turmeric and he eats this pretty uh, every single day so we usually give this uh, to him during dinner but during the day uh, we serve him with uh, some dry food from meal I wanna have kids on my own, yeah. Live a life till it's over. What do we do? It's sleeping too long. Once I'm done towel drying him, I use the hair dryer to blow dry his hair further in order to get rid of the excess water. And once I'm done doing that, I leave him uh, to dry naturally under the sun. Yeah, so we also use these uh, eye drops for ginger that have been recommended by his vet. And uh, this is very common among Persian kids. They get this uh, kind of brownish discharge from their eyes that occurs due to the overflow of tears. Uh, but it's very common. It's nothing uh, serious. 
Now, after giving Ginger a bath, uh, I was completely tired, so I took some rest and then later at night after taking a shower, uh, I decided to continue with the cheesecake making process. Now, tiramisu is a classic Italian coffee flavored dessert. Tiramisu means cheer me up in Italian, which is a perfect explanation for this beautiful dessert because it is so incredibly delicious. It is a coffee flavored dessert that contains mascarpone cheese, cream cheese, sugar, cocoa powder and lady fingers. The combination of cream and cheeses makes it rich and flavorful. One of the key rules of tiramisu is the final dust of cocoa powder on top which makes it look incredibly wonderful. And finally, it's my birthday. Three, two, one.
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Delilah. Happy birthday to you. May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you. Happy birthday to you. Well, it was definitely an emotional day for me. Um, I had a lot of friends over, a lot of my neighbors over, my relatives over. Uh, yes, I was missing a few of them and uh, that's why it was a little bit emotional for me. But um, I hope to see my friends, all of them together again for the next year, celebrating it in another bigger way. To all my virtual friends out there, a piece of cake to you guys as well.
setting up the table for dinner, we have mom's speciality that is mutton biryani, some raita. And for the desserts, we have my birthday cake, the dessert that I prepare that's tiramisu cheesecake and a special birthday cake prepared by my cousin Sibyl. Before commencing with the dinner, mum made a short prayer thanking God for the beautiful day and also the grace before meals. So now since everyone had left, it was time to clean the house, put things in place, organize everything, put the dirty laundry to wash. And as I did so, mum was busy doing the dishes in the kitchen. Well, as you can see, everyone liked the tiramisu cheesecake and the cake prepared by my cousin.
It was indeed mouth-watering and delicious and I was very happy that everyone liked it. Well, my mom doesn't like to keep the dirty dishes for the next day. She likes her sink to be neat and clean and empty. I also helped her by bringing together all the dirty dishes, by emptying the dishes with the leftovers into containers. Uh, she also rinsed the uh, dishes with some lukewarm water in order to get rid of all the greasiness, the oil and the odour. Thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed today's vlog and if you did please do not forget to like subscribe and click on the bell button to get notified for further videos also do follow me on instagram at heythedelilah.10 hope to see you soon in my next video